Let it go. Okay, next. Ah, oh, finally. Whoa. <laughs> I'm sorry, can I, could, could you? What happened to the other Santa? Listen, we've been waiting this line for a really long time, and we just want a Santa that actually looks like Santa. Mitchell, so, it's, no, it's okay. No, no, Cam, it's not okay. This is Lily's first Christmas. I want to make sure everything is perfect, and we're going to wait for the fat Santa, all right? I knew this would happen. I, I don't even know why we hired this guy. See? Even his elves agree with me. Thank you. Giant plastic phone. Giant plastic pipe. Whoa, 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 whoa. You want to tell me what you're doing here? Oh, what? You're going to play tough? You're clowns, right? I throw knives. <laughs> We're just looking for a buck, that's all. Buck here is going to knock this nose off my face with a knife. Why does everyone think the clown stuff is there for everyone? This is our stuff. Who ordered the job? I can't tell you. He'll kill me. What do you think is going to happen to you if you don't tell us? You got a name for us now, huh? You got a name? Digor. His name's Digor Ibarra. He's doing something big. Planted some kind of political stairs. What happened? Put a gun in my head and told me to tell him exactly when the job was going down. I guess he figured he'd let you do the dirty work and steal a small box from me so he wouldn't have to pay, okay? Now that's all I know, I swear to God. You killed my sister, you son of a bitch. Hey, don't cross this tape. I don't want you getting your footprints all over my freshly waxed floors. Sorry, Bird. Do you wax every day? No, not every day. Maybe if I'm gonna hit the beach, strut around in my mankini, then I'm... I was asking about the floors. <laughs> yeah, every day. Okay. Oh, okay. I think we got enough of the kids. Yeah. Why don't we uh, get some footage of you interacting with your coworkers now? Good idea. Pull your jets, Marcus. This reality show isn't starring you, it's starring me. And it's called... Uh, the World's Greatest Agent. Agent. And it called that, they did. <laughs> We're going to be shadowing Mr. Gold for a few days. Listen, we're just going to be here a few minutes, and then we're going to go out, capture me doing some more exciting things. Like, OK, look, you promised us Marcus Jackson. Mm -hmm. If you can't deliver, we're pulling the plug and taking the money back. No, oh, follow me. Cool choice on this suit, Mr. Two. She's got to notice me in this. Notice you? Charlie, that waitress's eyes will be on you like flies on the... Flies on the... What's that saying? Never mind. Let's go. You gotta try their mashed potatoes. Are we gonna need a reservation? You kidding? They know me here. You? Again? Well, they do know you here. Come on. I'm just trying to help out my friend Charlie. What? <laughs> Table for two. <laughs> That's us, dude. Then he hasn't closed the door to dating Christabel. He's just doing a favor for her hideously deformed friend. <gasps> You're going through the front door. He's going through the back door. He's a back door man. It's a time honored technique. What am I going to do? Easy. Shadowing. Shadowing? Yeah, just make sure they're never alone together, where he can impress her without you being there to deflect it. Nobody can deny it. You got a good thing going on. You got me spinning like a yo-yo as you're playing me on.